Hi, welcome to another episode of Atkins Dog in the Kitchen. My name is Kent Altona, and this week we're going to be making a, another kind of snack recipe or appetizer type recipe. It's called armadillo eggs. So you might be thinking, well, armadillos don't lay eggs? Well, these do. So follow along with me and we'll uh, start making it up. All right, so I have four ounces of green cheese in this container. To that, I'm going to add half a teaspoon of garlic powder. and a half teaspoon of cumin. To this I'm going to add about two ounces of cheddar or Mexican cheese and I'm going to mix this all together. I have my oven preheating right now at 375 degrees, so it'll be ready for when we need it. All right, so it's adequately mixed together at this point. So this is a Southwest recipe. So I am going to be using jalapeno peppers for these. And I'm going to be scraping out the center like I have in other recipes. Mainly trying to get the ribs and the seeds out of the jalapeno pepper. And then I'm going to quarter the halves. I'll do one more. Now I've done four of these already, so this will be, that was number five, and here's number six. Chop them in half, and cut off the stems. Alright. So, here's what we're going to do. We're going to take the jalapeno halves and we're going to stuff them with the cream cheese and cheddar mixture. And then we're going to wrap them in um, sausage and lay them on my uh, foil lined sheet pan. So what we want to do is take one of the jalapeno balls quarters and take about a third of a pound of sausage and hollow it out and stuff it with the jalapeno and then seal it up afterwards and basically you've got the jalapeno sealed inside the sausage so at this point, I'm going to take roughly a half a cup of Parmesan, put it into my little pan, and shake the ball. And basically, I just want to get a good coating of Parmesan cheese over the top of the armadillo egg. All right, now that the top is covered, I'm going to put it on my sheet. I'll do it one more time. Stuff the jalapeno quarter. Take about a third pound of sausage. Hollow it out. Put the jalapeno in there and then fold the sausage over top and seal in the edges. And then take it in here, give it a good shake, and coat it with Parmesan cheese. There, I got two down. I got probably about 12 to 15 more to go. 
I'll catch back up for you when I get ready to put them in the oven. All right, so I'm just finishing up the last one now. So I'll show it to you one more time. Put the cream cheese in the middle. Take about an ounce or two of the sausage using your fingers. Create a crevice in the middle. Put the cream cheese jalapeno mixture in the middle and just fold the sausage over top, sealing the edges. You can roll it in your hands to make the ball even better. And then put in the Parmesan cheese and roll it around, getting it fully covered. Another idea, if you don't have Parmesan cheese around, you could be using uh, crushed pork rinds as well. All right, so I got my 15 out of basically a pound and three-fourths of sausage, and I'm gonna put them in the oven for about 15 to 20 minutes. We'll catch back up at that point. The timer went off just a few seconds ago, and I uh, had put them on broil for about three minutes, and we finished them off. As you can tell, some of them leaked, but most of them held, with, uh, held in their cream cheese and their cheese mixture. So, looking good. I'll talk to you guys later. Thank you guys for watching. Have a great weekend. Bye.